Hi everyone and welcome to another video, I hope you're well. Today's video was shot at Columbus Quay at the end of March and we have cod in the video so stick around for that. Stick around to the end as always and I'll go through with you as well on the maps uh, the different places that we went that day. So without further ado, here's the video. Well guys, I'll tell you what, you can probably tell by how much that's rattling. We picked a blooming day today, I can tell you. I couldn't leave the audio in that clip any longer. It was absolutely atrocious. It wasn't actually forecast to be that windy um, that day, but it ended up being, that's, that's the kind of thing that can happen. As you can see, as I pan around, there's loads of uh, snow clouds gathering. Snow showers were forecast that day. But we got a lull in the weather and that allowed us to go and get the worm. Safe to say I didn't bother with much of the pumping session for recording it. Um, but I'll show you in a minute just how uh, lovely this guy was looking that day. Even if it was a bit wild. As I've said, there's no audio because of the wind. But I thought I'd film the newly formed gully for you. I know I've shown you in previous videos. And people have mentioned as well how much the beach has changed for the fishing. Near Derby Pool here as well. So I just thought I'd show you how deep it is as well. There with my dad standing in it. So, as ever, just be careful when you're fishing that at night, because that could possibly catch you out. So all the cakes today, guys, are... Take it away, Maestro. Rock buns. Rock buns. I thought I thought we were going... I thought we were saying they were a rock bun scone hybrid. I can't tell them. We can, we can tell them of that. Right. So they're a rock bun scone hybrid. And hang on, you didn't tell me what they were, though. Blueberry in them. Blueberry. Anything else? Sultanas. Sultanas. Currants. Currants. Orange peel. Orange peel. That's it. <laughs> well, there you go, viewers. Don't get jealous. Right, we'll get this broom and we'll get some fishing done. <laughs> Catch you in a bit.
Hi everyone. So, first cast in with the red rod and it's a codlin, exactly 35 centimeters. So what I'll do, I'll pop them in a bucket and if we get anything bigger, I'll just focus in on him a bit. I'll pop him in a bucket of water and if we get anything bigger, um, we'll let him go. But if not, then he's coming home for the table. Yeah, that's a good start, so we'll see what else we can get. I'll catch you in a bit. Two, like, just like that <laughs> bites just like that and uh, it snagged me up twice and I've let it free itself out of the snag twice so I've got my gear back twice luckily anyway I'm going to go and I think I'm going to get another bite on that so I'll go and see to that now I'll catch you in a bit
go. There we have a small cod lane. I'll get him measured and I'll get him back. Into the car from my court. Um, I think the old man's had a fish. What have we got? A little codling. Oh, lovely. Let's have a closer look at him. There we go, guys. Have a little cod for us. A little codling. See him all there. Put the colours on him again. 27 centimeters. This guy. Take that look, mate. Get that way for you. Right, we'll get him back. Let's try and get some more.
Might as well, that's the that's the first for us. Oh, I'll just turn my torch off. That's the first for us, a, a dogfish, a cat shark, off of Columbus Key. But it could be something to do with. Let me show him you. Could be something to do with us using fish baits. We'll put some bluey on today. Seems to have uh, brought the dogs out. Let's show him you. Try and show him you in a bit more detail. All the markings on the dog. Member of the shark family, obviously. Right, we're getting back anyway. tide now I'm just coming up to it the bites have gone off a bit my dad's had a, uh, a dogfish to beat the blank and I think he's are you happy about that yeah he didn't seem too pleased about it as soon as he saw it was a doggy but I think doggies get too much of a bad rap they're always a good blank saver and they're such a nice fish well many a uh, Many an angler would disagree. Pest species, many angler would say. Anyway, we'll see if we can winkle any more fish out for you. Catch you in a bit. everyone so another little codling estimate to be about about 27 then i think i'll double check with the measurement anyway let's have a look right, there he is nice markings on him that one session done with um was it four cod in the end four cod four, 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 four codling and a doggy a doggy I, I, I quite like a doggy i mean i know what you're like you're old school you hate dog fish then again i suppose there's a lot of anglers out there that absolutely hate dog fish because they're just a pest but my personal opinion is take anything that comes anyway that's us done so until next time see you later hi everyone if you made it this far thanks for watching the video i do hope you liked it i'll go through with you now on the maps the different places we went that day so the two places on the video were here at new brighton where we pumped some worm and here at columbus key where we went fishing 
I've just zoomed in for you here to New Brighton where we pumped the worm. There's where we parked our car. And this was roughly the location of the gully you saw in the video. I'll not go into too much detail about the New Brighton area. I do go into a lot of detail on my other videos, so do check them out. So this is the location of Columbus Quay, as you can see, just off Riverside Drive. That's the actual corner there of Columbus Quay. I'll zoom in on there for you to give you a bit more detail. So as you can see, this is Columbus Quay and this is the corner that we fished on. That is where we parked our car and we just walked down this ramp and to the corner there. As I say, my other videos of Columbus Quay do go into a bit more detail on the area so do check that out well that's about it for another video and thanks for watching once again uh, do like and subscribe if you want to and hit the bell notification icon if you want to be notified of our next videos do check out our other videos as well if you haven't already done so and uh, thanks for all the uh, comments and the subscriptions that we're getting at the moment as well much appreciated so until next time see you later